Welcome. This is the Green Bar Valley Church of, your Naz of the Nazarene with your daily devotion for Tuesday, March the 1st. Today we continue to read the 63rd Psalm. We will read verses 6 through 11. Here's the word of the Lord. On my bed I remember you. I think of you through the watches of the night. Because you are my help, I sing in the shadow of your wings. I cling to you. Your right hand upholds me. Those who want to kill me will be destroyed. They will go down to the depths of the earth. They will be given over to the sword and become food for jackals. But the king will rejoice in God. All who swear by God will glory in him. While the mouths of liars will be silenced. And that is the word of the Lord. The article today by Mike Strip is God's Got You. Here's what Mike says. For those of us who have experienced sleepless nights, we know that tension and worry can do to our bodies. The assault of our imaginations can bring about sleeplessness, stress, and fatigue. In this personal psalm, David is under attack and his enemy is seeking to destroy him. David is a mighty warrior. And yet he lies awake thinking, praying, and contemplating his own life and future. However, do not miss the hope that is nested in Psalm 63. Just like David, we are to remember that God is faithful. God stands with us in the watches of the night. We are not alone. Remember this when we lie down on our beds and ponder our past experiences, present realities, and future possibilities. Verse 7 teaches us, You are my help. I sing in the shadow of your wings. The metaphor is a priceless reminder that God protects us as an eagle protects its young. The Lord will bring peace and calm when we are under attack, worried, or in despair. Remember, God's got you in the watches of the night. The hymn is by Eliza E. Hewitt, Hewitt, Singing I Go. The trusting heart to Jesus clings, nor any ill forebodes, but at the cross of Calvary sings, Praise God for lifted loads. And from the book of Isaiah, chapter 26, verses 3 and 4. You will keep in perfect peace those whose minds are steadfast because they trust in you. Trust in the Lord forever, for the Lord, the Lord himself, is the rock eternal. Please continue to pray for all those in Ukraine. Thank you, and this is your daily devotion for Tuesday, March the 1st. Have a blessed day.